National Park Service in partnership with National Environmental Standards and Regulatory Enforcement Agency, NESRA, has embarked on a sensitization campaign on bushmeat consumption to markets in the FCT. Conservator of Park, Dr. Abdulrahman Mohammed, disclosed this while on a sensitization campaign to Goza Market, Airport Road in Abuja. Mohammed said the purpose of the campaign was to educate people, especially bushmeat vendors, on zoonotic diseases and dangers it posed to human health. The main and objective of our outing is just to sensitize the public about the significance of zoonosis. Zoonosis is generally a disease that can be transmitted from man to animal or animal to human. And basically, to some extent, they have interest to bush meat. Then, just to educate the people, those that are into it, those that are vendor into bush, uh, bush meat, to avoid it. There are a whole list of diseases of zoonotic importance that originate from wild lives. That is bush meat that people consume. Is it TB? You call that tuberculosis. The origin is from them. The Ebola that we had some years back. And currently, the corona that we are having has a threat to the wildlife. Said the campaign will be continuous, and the first target was Kuje Area Council and Abuja Municipal Area Council. Mohammed, however, said funding was needed to continue to support the exercise. He advised the public to avoid buying bush meat as the best option to avoid the disease. As we are processing the meat for people, other people to come and consume, you stand the chance of having the infection. And by the time you close from work, your children, mommy, welcome, or your husband, my darling, welcome, and you transfer the disease to him. And that's all. The best option is to avoid it. Bushmeat seller, who spoke to me of Nigeria, thanked the organizers of the program and promised to abide by the rules. They say Bushmeat used to bring, uh, there will see many sickness, corona, like this corona, welcome. We don't hear Una. But our own, I will tell my people, to stop buy bush meat. If they bring bush meat for any way, we will not, we will not buy the bush meat again. To so abide by the rules, then avoid the spray. And if I want to buy the bush meat, I will know the way to buy it. Since they have enlightened us that there is a way to test it, then we will not take it there, we will not follow the process of it. So I have to avoid this. Mr. Baba Aduga Mukailu, market manager, Kuje Area Council, thanked National Park and Nezra, adding that he was impressed with the program. The relation is okay because, based on what is happening in the country today, as um, this issue of um, um, this COVID 19 is a pandemic that will ravage the whole nation if care is not taken. But by this, with this sensitization now, I believe. My people here in the market have, got, have gotten full information of what is all about bush meat. So this thing has been in them for long and it will be very difficult to eradicate it immediately, but it will be minimized. And uh, by so doing, I hope on my own, at my own level, I will always make sure that I'm in contact with them often and often to ensure that this thing is totally eliminated.